हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टेक्नेट गाइड फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू कॉन्फ़िगर क्लस्टर इन चेक पॉइंट फायरवॉल सो फ्रेंड्स इन टर्म ऑफ चेक पॉइंट पॉइंट क्लस्टर पर रेडोडेंसी इन नेटवर्क सो फ्रेंड्स देर इज थ्री मोड इन चेक पॉइंट फायरवॉल फर्स्ट इज एच मोड हाई एवेबिलिटी मोड इन हाई एवेबिलिटी एट ए टाइम वन फायरवॉल विल बी एक्टिव एंड अदर फायरवॉल विल बी स्टैंड बाई सो सेकेंड इज लोड शेयरिंग मल्टीकास्ट मोड इन लोड शेयरिंग मल्टीकास्ट मोड बोथ फायरवॉल विल बी एक्टिव एंड बोथ फायरवॉल विल शेयर फिफ्टी फिफ्टी परसेंट ट्रैफिक एंड थर्ड वन इज लोड शेयरिंग यूनिकास्ट मोड सो इन दिस टर्म वन फायरवॉल विल बी इन प्राइवेट मोड ओके इट विल शेयर थर्टी परसेंट ट्रैफिक एंड अदर फायरवॉल विल बी शेयर सेवेंटी परसेंट ट्रैफिक Why it will share seventy percent traffic and fire private firewall will share thirty percent traffic because private firewall will take decision which traffic sent to other firewall for process and which and which traffic private firewall will process. So is taking decision. So it will process only thirty percent traffic. Okay, this is my topology here on which we are going to perform live. This is my firewall one, and this is firewall two. Okay, this is my inside network. One ninety two one sixty eight ten dot zero. My firewall one inside IP is ten dot one one ninety two one sixty eight ten dot one. Other firewall inside interface IP ATH one IP is ten dot two. Okay, so here here will be my virtual IP. Virtual IP will be ten dot hundred. For this network, for this network, my gateway will be virtual IP. All traffic will pass through this virtual IP, and this is my gateway. Because if I will put this gateway, then this firewall will be down. Our network will be down. So there is a virtual IP concept in checkpoint firewall. Okay. So in outside zone, my नेटवर्क इज फोर डॉट टू डॉट टू डॉट जीरो ओके हियर माई वर्चुअल आई पी विल बी फोर डॉट टू डॉट टू डॉट हंड्रेड एंड ए टी एस टू इंटरफेस आउटसाइड फायरवॉल वन आई पी एड्रेस फोर डॉट वन ए टी एस टू इंटरफेस फॉर फायरवॉल टू आई पी एड्रेस फोर डॉट टू डॉट टू डॉट टू ओके सो सो फोर दिस गेट वे विल बी फोर डॉट टू डॉट टू डॉट हंड्रेड एंड दिस इज माई ए टी एस थ्री Inter it is three sync interface. It will be sync. Okay, sync interface will synchronize active firewall connection table, state table connection table to standby firewall. Okay, and it will also send hard bit to standby firewall. So let's see how to configure. Go to smart dashboard. So friend, now we have to go to smart dashboard. Okay. Here is my smart dashboard. Login here. Here is my smart dashboard. Show you interfaces of my firewall. Here is my firewall one. So I will show you interface. F W get ifs. This is my firewall one interfaces and IP address. Okay, it is zero is my management. Seventy dot two hundred is my firewall IP management IP address, and E T H one ten dot one. ATS two four dot ATS two is four dot one okay and ATS three sync interface is one dot one okay and firewall two let's say check firewall two IP address my firewall two IP address is seventy dot two hundred two zero two and ATS one IP address is ten dot two and ATS two outside interface IP four dot two dot two dot two And sync interface IP is one dot two. Okay, so now go to smart dashboard, and here we will add gateway, both gateway here. Okay, click here and click on gateway. Now click on wizard mode. Now provide the firewall name firewall one. Open server in my case. Provide the management IP address of firewall one seventy dot. Two zero one. Okay. Now click on next. 
now here we have to establish trust with sikki provide sikki here okay then click on next now you can see trust established here now click on finish now go to network management and we have to fetch topology here okay click on okay now we have to add another firewall firewall 2 gateway fw2 open server in my case 192.168.70.202 then click on next provide sick key here and then click on next now sick established here click on finish go to network management <laughs> click on get and fetch use topology fetch topology here ok now we have added both the gateway now we have to create cluster here click on cluster and cluster wizard mode now provide the cluster name cluster a provide the cluster name ok so here cluster ip 192.168.210 this is my cluster ip so we are going to configure high availability later we'll see load sharing okay so click on next now we have to add gateway we have to add gateway here both gateway existing gateway click on one add yes now add another gateway firewall 2 click on add yes yes now then click on next here click on next now this is my sync interface so we have to select cluster synchronization okay then click on next and this is my outside interface okay so we will keep in cluster okay now provide the virtual IP address folder 2.2.2.100 and simulate mask 0 then click on next so this is my inside zone inside network so we will keep in cluster one and virtual IP address provide here 10.100 ok subnet mask 0 and click on next and this interface I will keep as a private because I if my management interface goes down I don't want to switch over or fail over ok now, now click on next click on finish here so friends you can see cluster is created here we have added both the gateway in cluster double click on it cluster now click on cluster member here you can see firewall 1 priority is high and firewall 2 priority is low so we you can increase priority from here which firewall will be active and ok now go to cluster excel so you can see here is a high availability we will configure first high availability then we will later will see load sharing ok click on network management click on network management here so you can see virtual ip firewall 1 ip address firewall 2 ip address here is virtual ip so now click on ok then click on publish here and click on install database database installed here so before going to install policy let's check here cluster status cpha probe stat module HA module not started now we have to install policy click on install policy and click on install now friends go to firewall 1 and run command cp ha probe state cp ha probe state <coughs> press enter 
now you can see my firewall 1 is active and firewall 2 is standby mode okay now go to firewall 2 run command here cpha pro state so you can see local firewall is firewall 2 for firewall 2 is this one is local and standby and firewall 1 local firewall is active okay so now run this command cpha probe minus a if interface status management interface when disconnected okay no issue eth1 is up eth2 is up and sync interface is up this is my virtual ip for inside and this is for outside okay so now let's check traffic here ping 4.2.2.10 minus t okay you can see i'm able to ping from so friends you can see i am able to ping from this pc this is my lan pc okay i'm able to ping from here to here okay so successfully is working so now let's check here firewall status is firewall one is my active firewall okay now we will do one thing here we will shut down inside interface we will shut down this interface and we will see ping status okay set interface eth1 state off we will do off and we will see what will happen and also we will monitor ping response state off and here is my ping response you can see no any packet dropped here and we'll see firewall status cluster status so you can see firewall one local firewall is down and firewall two is active okay go to firewall two okay local firewall is active and this is standby okay so now enable this interface so again we will see state so firewall one is standby okay now we will see now we will see multicast mode okay so go to smart dashboard and go to cluster and click on cluster excel brp now we will configure here load sharing multicast we will select here load sharing then we will see both firewall will pass 50 50 percent traffic now click on install policy now click on install policy here now publish now click on install now policy installation success now let's see our cluster status you can see both firewall is active and both firewall is passing 50 50 percent traffic okay in load setting multicast both firewall will be active and both firewall will pass 50 percent 50 percent traffic okay you can see now we will see third mode now we will see load setting unicast mode click on cluster excel and here we will select unicast okay click on ok and install policy and we will see what happened now policy installed now policy installed successfully now go to firewall one run command again cpha probe state now this is my now friends this is my local firewall active and pivot mode pivot mode means it will process only 30 percent traffic and other firewall will process 70 percent traffic because why this firewall process only 30 percent traffic because this is pivot mode it will take so this firewall is responsible to take decision which traffic pass to other firewall 
for process and which traffic keep this firewall for process. This, that's why this firewall will process only 30% traffic. Okay. In this video, you have seen how to configure cluster in checkpoint firewall. So thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.